I joined Savills on the graduate scheme back in 2018. I came in on the commercial rotation programme. Sort of in the later stages of university, I started to question my sexuality, I'd say. But with various things going on in life, being in my final year of university, I put it to the back burner, so to speak. Once I kind of finished university and moved back home, I really started to think, right, let's kind of explore this. And it kind of coincided with the same time that I started at Savile. So it was battling with quite a lot as to what was going on in my own head. Um, but not long after sort of starting at Savile, you know, I started to become, you know, realising myself that I was gay and I identified as gay. Um, and just as anyone goes through the motions, you start to tell people, um, you know, your family, your friends, eh, and eventually colleagues as well. I was very fortunate that everyone was very supportive of it. You know, I never received any negativity, so to speak. Um, I know a lot of people do in life, unfortunately, but you know, I had a very positive experience. Um, you know, I started on the graduate scheme at the same time as a, a colleague who also identified as that and was openly out. And so having them there to kind of support me through it was really fantastic. Um, and yeah, really helped me in my own journey as well. Working in what is quite a male dominated um, heterosexual industry, as an openly gay man, I feel it's really important for me to share my story and uh, to show to others who are maybe going through a similar experience that I went through six years ago that there isn't anything to be afraid of, although it may seem daunting at the time because um, you've got a million things going through your head. Actually, everyone's very accepting. Um, it's a great industry to be a part of and you can really have a fantastic career in it if you're passionate about it. So something like your sexuality shouldn't be a hurdle for you to get over. If I was giving advice to anyone coming into the industry, I would personally just say, you know, don't be afraid to be your unapologetic self. You're always going to face hurdles in life. I'm a very firm believer of everything happens for a reason, even if it is not apparent immediately. It can be a very daunting process, but at the end of the day, you deserve to be happy. Everyone deserves to be happy, no matter what. You should just let the industry embrace it.